Aqua Barrier 2 Component Cement-Based Elastic Waterproofing Membrane Aqua Barrier is a two-part polymer-modified cementitious waterproof slurry comprising a liquid polymer part and cement-based powder part. When mixed and applied, it cures to a flexible elastomeric membrane, protecting concrete, pillars, beams, etc. from the deterioration and mechanical decay caused by carbonation and aggressive elements. For elastic waterproofing and insulating bearing structures for baths and swimming pools before installing the ceramic tiles. Waterproofing showers, terraces, and roofs before installing covering materials or cladding. Flexible smoothing on prefabricated concrete constructions subject to vibrations and warping. As a waterproofing membrane and to protect the foundation walls. Features of Aqua Barrier Waterproofing. It is highly flexible and accommodate thermal movement of the substrate. Superior crack bridging and high adhesion with substrates. High resistance to chloride and other salts. Protects against carbonation. Breathable. It stops water ingress but allows the substrate to breathe. Applicable standards. ASTM D751. EN 12390. Hyphen 8. And EN 14891. surface preparation. The substrate must be sound, flat, compact, have no parts coming away, and be free of dust, grease, form release oils, paint, wax, rust, or efflorescence. Repair any holes or uneven sections. With concrete bases, remove any cast joint burrs and wait at least 30 days for setting. Before applying, drench the substrate with water and remove the surplus with compressed air, a liquid suction system, or absorbent cloths to obtain a slightly damp base with a dry surface. Mixing quantity. White liquid, part A, equals 8 kg and gray powder, part B, equals 20 kg. Yield. 16 liters. 28 kg unit. During the summer. Keep the packs of aqua barrier away from direct sunlight before use. Pour the liquid into a mixing pail. Add the powder slowly into the liquid while mixing. Use a suitable mixing paddle in a slow speed drill, 400 to 600 revolutions per minute. Mix until you get a lump free, slightly viscous slurry is obtained, and this should be achieved within 2 to 3 minutes. Application of Aqua Barrier Waterproofing Slurry and Net. Ensure there is no freestanding water on the substrate before application. Consistently applies the Aqua Barrier Slurry Coat to a pre-dampened substrate. High absorbing substrates may require more dampening than dense substrates. Aqua Barrier Slurry Coat can be applied by brush, roller, and broom. Ensure that the first coat has well worked into the substrate without any gap. Use of Aqua Barrier Net. Aqua Barrier Slurry must be reinforced with Aqua Barrier Net across all construction joints, bends, and hairline cracks. The Aqua Barrier Net is an alkali-resistant glass fiber mesh. When waterproofing terraces, balconies, or swimming pools, we always recommend you add Aqua Barrier Mesh to the first layer of the Aqua Barrier. Aqua Barrier Net application is part of the first coat of application. During the first coat application in the thickness of 1 to 1.5 mm and is still wet, Lay the net and press it down gently with the trowel to be embedded in the product. Aqua Barrier Net Sheets must overlap by at least 10 cm.
Depending on the temperature, it may take about 30 minutes to 2 hours to apply the final coat. The entire waterproofing dry film thickness reaches 2 mm with the application of the last layer. Do not add water, aggregates, or hydraulic binders. If the mixture is already hardening, do not attempt to use additional water or part of liquid to make it workable again. Before using the product, please read the latest technical and safety data sheets, and it is recommended that you consult Laticrete Technical Service before beginning the waterproofing application. Please like and subscribe our YouTube channel and click the bell icon to get new video updates. For additional information, please visit our website www.laticrete.me.